So how do you guys avoid a letdown? You got, I mean, they're, they haven't won a game yet in the conference, and you can't look past them. Um, I think we just have to go out every game and just play our hardest from the beginning, no matter who we're playing. And um, they're playing better basketball than we, than we, than we played them previously. And um, we just have to go out there and focus from the tip. I guess Coach Carey brought up the, what happened in Lubbock over the weekend when they were in the state Yeah, um, we talked about that, just about how um, they're moving the ball well. Um, players are stepping up, and um, they're not a team that you can look past. And like you can see, it was a close game against Oklahoma State, so we can't look past them. We just we have to be ready to play. Baylor, Baylor, Baylor. You don't win tomorrow night. Baylor's Right. All season long, it's just been taking it one game at a time and making sure we win that game, so it doesn't change tomorrow. We just need to go out there and play hard. And um, focus on that game and then focus on Baylor. They lost most of their starters from last year. They have a new coach. It's a totally different team. How you didn't play against them last year? Um, yeah, and I think even from the previous time we played them, um, they're even better than they were. So um, I think it's just the same, just really focus and um, play West Virginia basketball and play for 40 minutes. I know it's one thing to say that we got to be focused so forth. As a senior, you've been around a lot of teams. Do you sense that this team you know, is indeed zeroed in? Yeah, because we have five seniors that are able to lead the team. And, um, you know, if some, someone's not focused, we have someone who can, you know, make them refocus. And just we know what our goals are, and this is just one step closer to it. I know this is new territory for a lot of players. You haven't been in this position with three games left where you've got you know, a chance, chance to win the league title and, and do a lot of things the program hasn't done. What's, what's it like as a player? Um, it puts pressure on you just because you want those accomplishments and those uh, championships so bad, but you also just have to think about the right now and go to practice, practice hard every day. Um, make sure the team is encouraged and ready to play every day and it's just kind of a, a big thing for leadership and experience that we've had games over the years. Who's this team defensively right now? You know, when you hold a, a team, regardless of who it is in the Big 12, the 40 or 40 or whatever it was over the weekend, and scoring rounds, is this some of the best team defense that we've played since you Yeah, we've always pride ourselves on defense and um, that hasn't changed. We've been trying to play for a full 40 minutes, and um, you know, like I've always said, if we're not scoring, um, we can play defense and make sure the other team doesn't score. So each game and every possession, we just try to get stops and um, break up the other team's offense.